YouTube, we back at it again with another tutorial. Uh, my voice might sound a little crazy. I lost my voice after being live on Instagram, hosting wave battles and whatnot. But we bring in the content still. So I did do a different fade system in this haircut. So I'm gonna tell you guys what I did and how I did it. So right now I'm starting my bald line. I'm not at the bottom of the vertical bar, but kind of towards the bottom, just not all the way to the bottom. I'm doing a slight drop, and um, I'm doing the same thing on the other side with a slight drop again. So now I'm taking my hitters, basically just, just bringing that bulk down, creating space for me to fade at the top. And I'm leaving that darker contrast at the bottom so it can allow me to see my fade easier. Now I'll take my Babyless Clippers. I'm going to use the lever open and set my first guideline in about a half inch. But make sure you, when you guys are setting your guidelines in, you go over it multiple times just to make sure that those guidelines are even. All right, so next step, we're going to take that bottom line out immediately, just closing the lever, and you're just going to flick from the bottom of the line, flick to the line, and flick out. And uh, when taking this bottom guideline out, adjust the lever as needed to blend that first guideline. As you can see in the back, I am struggling to take that bottom guideline out. We will come back with the liners and take, get that bottom guideline out. As right here, I pointed to it and I'm using the corners of my liners. I'm trying to get that bottom line out. Now I'm using my one guard closed. So basically this new phase system, well it's not even new. I did a video on it a couple times using this phase system. I just, I'm just not coming back to it, okay? So I'm using my one closed and I'm going up, I would say a centimeter, okay? But basically this, what this phase system is, you're gonna use every notch on the lever. So if your clippers have notches on it, you can do this system if it doesn't have notches you probably can still do it it just won't be as efficient for you but there are four notches on this clipper so i'm going to use every notch, every notch starting from close to open so after i set my guideline which is basically a centimeter you're going to go to the next notch go another go up another centimeter and just keep doing that with every notch until you go until you're fully open once you're fully open, you can basically take take off whatever is at the top because the sides are going to be a 1.5 anyway. So yeah, now I'm on the second notch, going up another centimeter.
as you can see it's going up another centimeter um this is basically just creating gradients you could just do the lever open and then the one guy open and then flick it out the middle with the lever i mean with the zero guy closed but i want to bring more value to my haircuts i want to get my blends better and um i've been studying some barbers and i was stole this foot fading system <laughs> and use it my way so that's how i've been doing it perfect um my blends and haircuts Well, the fourth, fourth one and the third one, it's the one before the last knot, <laughs> before it's fully open. Now, you're going to see me go all the way up in the back. That's because the back is automatically darker than the red, than the sides. So, by me going that, that notch below fully open and going up all the way in the back, it kind of adds more gradients. Like, it's almost like... It's almost like an equation, you know what I'm saying? So it equals an equal fade all the way around. But if I would use the one guy all the way open at the top of the back, it would look darker than the sides. So now I just use my lever all the way open and I'm taking it all the way to the top, whatever left at the top of the fade. So now you can see the middle line easily. Now you're gonna take that zero guard close and adjust adjust the lever as needed when using it. Now a lot of you guys might ask me why I left that bulk at the bottom. It's just for contrast, you know what I'm saying? With it being dark like that, you can see spots in the fade that you wouldn't usually see or it's hard to see. And right now I'm doing detail work. I'm using that bottom part to see what I need what I need to perfect in the fade. So now that I got the pretty the fade pretty much done, I'm gonna take all that bulk off and then later in the come use the shaver. And you can see where I'm gonna use the shaver. Like there's a line where the darkness was at the bottom, and then there's it's just mad bright from the fade up. And I'm gonna use the shaver. It basically separates where you should use the shaver and where you shouldn't. Alright, so before we detail the face some more, just gonna get this lineup out the way. So because I went uh, one open on the sides, we're gonna do the same thing on the lineup. And my client did request enhancements. Okay, this is what he wanted. So I gave him what he wanted, and uh, he definitely liked it. This is what he always get. This is a loyal client. I sprayed that Tresemme hairspray, the five hold, and I blow dried it. And now we're just gonna get them crispy.
here we're just doing more detail work trying to get that fade as, as good as we can before we move on to the next step I see him lining up his eyebrows. He did want his eyebrows to get done, so I basically just brush the eyebrows up, line it up, and make it a straight line at the top, and then towards the side, make a diagonal line to connect to the top part. Most men usually don't line up the bottom part, but some people do. Right here, I'm just using the razor. Alright you guys, this is the finished cut. Let me know what you think. Let me know if I helped you in any way. More tutorials coming soon. More content coming soon. And let me know what you guys want to see. You know what I'm saying? Give me some ideas. I do like to I do read the comments, okay? I believe me. I read all of them. But yeah, it's your Wavy Kid Kev. Follow me on Instagram at WavyKev. WavyK underscore K, my bad. And uh, we out. Deuces.